go. So you suck. <laughs> Female, maybe fresh out of the shower, like yeah, you said. Yeah, so yeah. Exactly. Yeah. All right, so uh, introduce. Yeah, 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 inter- 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 All right, inter- um, hold on, Kev. We- hold on, Kev. Yeah, bro, you trying to antagonize the youth? Yeah, word. On, All right, so um, <laughs> I'm trying to. Oh, man, like I- I've seen, I've seen this kid for. I haven't seen him grow up, but I've seen him grow up. Hmm. Um. This is this is one of the kids that I met when I actually first started working back in the community center at Kipps Bay, and this this is this is someone who has always stood out to us as like the staff I'm referring to. Um, always had a great head on head on his shoulders, um, super super intelligent, having deep intellectual conversations at like 15 years old, um, and I met him when he was coming to Kipps Bay and he was playing basketball. Um, he was always had the dedication, always had the drive. Um, he was like the one, like one, someone that stands out. Um, every time you have a crowd, you may have two, three, maybe four people that just stand out that are just different. You can't really explain it, but you just know that they just have that it it factor. Hey. And this is um, one of those people who stood out in that crowd. And now, you know, he's doing really well for himself. Um, he's taken. He's he's now an artist. Um, he's still in school. Last year, last year, last in his last year of school. Um, and he's doing his thing. He's this is this is everything you would want. Um, your child to do: go to school, do what they need to do, get the grades that they need to get, graduate, and make yeah. something of themselves. Here so we go. You gonna make me blush, J. <laughs> hey. So without further ado, do you want to be introduced as your rap name or? Orphan why? But I'm Omar. Uh, Omar, 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 welcome, Omar, welcome, Omar, Omar, yes, welcome, yes, man, yes. welcome. Thank you, thank all right, you. All right, real quick, JT, what's off limits, man? Um, how old are you? Seventeen. Ah, uh, a lot. Okay, yeah. here we go. Gotta change <laughs> the mind. Gotta take these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody, he's drinking water. <laughs> he's drinking water. Uh, I understand. Not water. Uh, yeah, slide that just yeah. so it won't look like it's yours. <laughs> Don't put uh, that over uh, there. Yeah, we're gonna talk about uh. I don't know, but we're gonna talk about something. Now we gonna be less. Um, <laughs> Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> that's my shit. He he he's sophisticated. Yeah. He can handle right, some real do, conversations. That's why it. he's let's here. It. It. But um, all right, now let's we left off. I remember you had a comment about um, if when you make it, how much do you owe oh, to yeah. the people that are coming with you? I feel like as the artist, if you're the one in the central making money, you gotta find a way to help your others get money. You got to give them the roles. They can't just come up and have a role. You got to give them a role. If they see you doing something, you if they not on your same mindset when it comes to getting money and they don't know how to play their role, then you do have to cut them off. Okay. So you you basically saying like you you the artist, right? Your friends come. Like you will help them pursue something that they would like. Like Yeah, you got to shift them. Oh, you know how to talk? All right, so you're going to run this MBBF podcast. MBBF is mm-hmm. not Blood But Family. That's my rap group. Mm-hmm. Oh, you... I like you, that you little, know, first of all, I'm not gonna like, I like that little plug you just did real quick. That's the green I the see. green sweatsuit that I be wearing. Oh, where? That's the... Oh, okay, yeah, okay, yeah, okay, okay. I like that little plug you just did. Yeah. <laughs> all right, okay. Smooth, smooth. Everybody follow that podcast too, man. Nah, we don't got one. Oh, bro, oh, were you oh, listening oh. to what he said, bro? Nah, I thought that he Damn, plugged it like, yo, I need you to do... I thought he was plugging his Bro, you got 30 minutes left. That's what I'm saying. Like, oh, shit like that. I thought you, well, now you need to start one now. Nah, I'll see about that. That's, that's a whole <laughs> different grind. That's a whole that. different like, grind. I thought that was a smooth plug. I was like, all right, forget it. Fuck it. Go ahead. But yeah, like you got. Oh, you know how to. You you you, you have an ear for music. I'm gonna mm-hmm. teach you how to make beats. Okay. I'm gonna teach you how to engineer. Oh, mm-hmm. you got the look. You could rap. All right. So I'm put you on. I'm put you in a music video, just like little baby did with Forty Two Doug. Even Forty Two Doug was rapping way long ago. He put him on again. Yeah. So what? What, it's, it's what simple about as that. what about the people that don't have no talent? And that's just your man's. You could find mm. a way to make somebody make money. They could learn something. They could learn A and R. They could learn marketing. Mm. I like that. See, I I hear what you're saying. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm getting at. Like, how but do you have that? You want to just reap the benefits without doing nothing? You can't do that. Yeah, people like that though. I don't got them. All right, so let's now. let's let's have a fake conversation. I'm right. you the you the rapper. I'm the I'm the friend. You're trying to get me to do something. How would you go about it? 
and be like, oh, depends. I feel, oh, damn, that's tough. That you having a comp? Yeah, this is this is, is a, a fake a fake uh, right. scenario. Go ahead. We in the room. We all chilling. Hookah's lit. We we having fun. And where am I? You're at this point, you're, you're no, where, no, wherever like, you want like, to be as an artist. That's where you are. Yeah. All right. So say I'm fucking one of the biggest artists in there the world. There you go. All mm-hmm. right. At that point, I would already have their rose figures out. But say say we starting off, and I'm mm-hmm. starting to get to say I got okay. Say all right. Five, After the first video goes viral, and you get that first deal. Okay. All right. So all right. I got my verification check, a little mm-hmm. shit like that, mm-hmm. and I'm on the come up. Hmm. So you bring it up to them. You like, yo, there's a role that you gonna have to play. Like, no, you can't just do anything. Like, you, I mean, you can't just do nothing. Like, we are all gonna have to play a part for us to be successful. But we what, have to what work you mean? I gotta a unit. We have to work as a unit for us to make it somewhere like bigger than this. Mm-hmm. Because this is when I'm first popping off. Most people's rap careers they come and go. So what, what last, you, you, you got to build a team. What a you team mean? I need a role. Like I've been with you since day one. Like I played my role. I was there when you had nothing. Now you about to pop. Like, why do I like, what do you, I'm, I'm the right hand. I'm been there. I'm going to always be there. Mm-hmm. You can always count on me. It's like, why do yeah, I have I to always be... count on you? But how are you going to like, how are you, what are you going to do? Like you can't, nobody is ever should ever expect to, Eat off another man's plate. No handouts. Yeah. I feel like there's a table. Everybody has to have their own plate. And we have to find a way to make Let's each go, other. Let's go, man. I'm sorry. I got a touchdown. I respect that. Yo, bro, don't do that again, bro. My fault. My don't, fault. Don't, don't, don't disrespect I need my man like that again, bro. Don't do that again, bro. No, 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 no. I got him on fantasy. I got him on fantasy. Just, nah, I hear you. I hear you. He, he was on my fantasy. Go ahead. My fault. My fault. Nah, it's all good. I was basically. I was waiting for that all day. <laughs> That's so what are you telling him then? Mm. Him? Right there. He likes to talk. I told him I want him to run a podcast. I already told him to start one. He He's a good talker. I feel like he could chop it up with people. Time so out. why you ain't come Time out? out. Time <laughs> out, Kev. Yo. We need you to switch out. Kids, on come, on. come on, bro. Come, come on, on, bro. Come on. Five, come on. Minutes. Five minutes. Five minutes. Five minutes. Five minutes. Five minutes. No, <laughs> he says how to talk. This is this is your test. All right, so we can, you can be the voice in the background. Right. You can be the voice so in the can, background. Can we do this? You don't have to be on camera, right? All you have to do is just talk. The mic can swing this way. Mm-hmm. Come on. Ah, like. <laughs> but, that, but that's what it is, man. I know. Take the other lighter. Five minutes. Five minutes. Five minutes. That's cool. That's cool. Oh, and you got the hoodie on, but it's all good. He got the merch on. Nah, oh, you got that's it, what I'm saying. Bro. And you, you got the merch on, on, bro. Oh, like, on. Merch right, on. That's yo, you got to get on. You got to get on. Yeah, so why they try to get him on, right? So, like, what do you tell him, though? Like, how, how do you tell him, like, I need you to do this? I feel like he would want to What was to that conversation like? The convers- when, I, when I told him, mm-hmm. I, no, we, it just came up, to be honest. Like, I like, got your mans. We could just talk. I was, yeah, I was like, yo, you should start a podcast, bro. You you talk nice. You have good conversations. Mm-hmm. You play both sides. Mm-hmm. Start it. You see how it does. You just do it. Mm. I mean, I think it's it's one of those things where it's like it's easy to do it. It's easy to say it before it happens. But when it happens, and you yeah. really have to go through the process of losing somebody who was there with you from the bottom, yeah. I don't think it's as easy because I think like even with family, like it's gonna be hard. Yeah. Yeah, it's hard. Like it especially when you're the cash cow. Yeah. You're the bank. Like, I need a loan. I need help with this bill. I need our family has to fly out. I need you to pay for the tickets. Uh that's different. Um, that's helping somebody if they need the help. But but if you need the help, you're gonna I'm why wouldn't I just teach you how to get it on your own and you could just be part of a a, a cognitive machine? Because it's because, and I'm going to tell you this right now, most people don't understand business. Yep. Most yeah, people don't understand that. True. Most people can't understand the concept of, I have to have my own plate. Especially yeah. where in their mind, they feel like they were doing something for you. The whole time, yeah. And even in my plate. Like, yeah, like, there was on this, there was a sports podcast, and um, I, I think it was Chad Johnson and Brandon Marshall. And they was talking about I'll how on draft night, when somebody gets drafted, notice how everybody rich. is crying. Yeah. Everybody is crying. That is with that person. Word. But y'all wasn't out there on the field when I was out there getting tackled. Y'all wasn't the one making the catches. Y'all wasn't the one throwing the ball. Y'all wasn't doing nothing. But y'all crying for my success because in their eyes, we all made it. Mm-hmm. So now when you go through that, 
it's not going to be an easy process for people to, to it's definitely going to be tough. I know what he said was going to be easy, but it's something that's going to have to get done. So do you, are you willing to cut off people when that happens? Yes. Okay. Even the day ones. I, I that's the thing. I, I, I feel like I have these conversations already within my circle and I feel like we all. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got, we got the lead on Facebook. Man. Yeah. Hold on, we got to delete it on Facebook for some wow. reason. I don't I don't know. Somebody just told me. Yeah, they can't find it. All right, so we're going to... YouTube, we still here. Twitch, yeah, still YouTube, we still going. Second. Twitch, we still going. Uh, we back Facebook, Facebook, we back we on. We're going to wait. We're going to we just... Oh, yeah, everything. Yeah, we back on. We back on Facebook right now. So if you was if you was trying to get on Facebook and you can't find it, we should be back on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Let's, let's... That was weird. Yeah, that's crazy. I think because of the music, probably. That's the only thing I could... Facebook is weird like that, Facebook bro. Like it's that crazy because my ad, bro. I try to promote something. Nah, no, nah, you no promote more curse you words. Promote whatever you gotta do, in it, man. No one... I'm, nah, I'm saying when I try to promote a certain post, no more curse words. You can't, you can't put money into that post. Why? Because of curse words, profanity, and what? In like a, a Facebook ad or an Instagram ad. For real? Yeah. No more profanity. That shit crazy. I'm a grown ass man. Yeah, exactly. What I can say what I want. Like, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Like, you gonna tell me what I can and cannot say. All right, All right yeah, we, we back, back on now. We back, back on. Now. Sorry, about it. We don't even know that we got kicked off. Of Facebook, yeah, thank man. you, uh, Leah and Trick for letting us know. So Jack, yeah, plug We back on. Tell we back on. Yeah, we back on. We back on. We yeah, back. Everybody, on. we back on. We wait. Everybody, yeah, the numbers are going so, back. So all that, all that was for nothing. No, I don't even know how long they we've been off. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. It wasn't that long though. But um, no, he said it about almost almost eight minutes ago. Oh shit! So we oh, missed a lot. Shit. Um, all right, so go watch it on YouTube. Facts. Right there, anyway, go watch the video. <laughs> yeah, go watch the putback. <laughs> um, but I also wanted to talk like about that transition from like when you were playing. Like I don't know if you're still playing ball, but from when you were playing ball to being an artist, like what made you want to make that transition, and how did it go for you? Um, it kind of just happened to be honest. So I had like the basketball season, my sophomore year had just ended, right? I was still going to Kips Bay, started hanging out with, with people I used to hang out with, like from seventh grade, eighth grade, instead of with the kids I was hanging out with from high school. Mm -hmm. Um, and they were like, Jam Jameek was rapping, my mm -hmm. friend Robert was rapping, right? And I was like, all right, so one day in math class, I wrote a line. It just, I liked it, so I just kept. What, what, what was that line you wrote? Uh, nah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, you give me that one. <laughs> eh, nah, that wasn't it. That wasn't it. Nah, it's in a song, but I feel like I can't say that. Why not? It's like not a fire bar or something. Nah, it's just it's, it's uh, personal. Yeah, it's about a girl. Understand? Nah. Say like, yo, I love you, baby. That's nah. what you were saying. You ever rap to a girl before? How is it nah. personal if you put it on the song? True. Well, what song? <laughs> what song is it? My first song. Okay. It, it, the line was "Grew up with no father." Okay. Mm, I understand that. I understand that. Hey man, we all are in the same boat, man. Yeah, yeah real talk. For real, for I, real. I honestly, sometimes when you rap stuff or you say stuff, and that's you, just you, you never know your truth. who is who who can relate to you. Yeah. So like you could have said it, and I'm like, oh shit, man. That, that, that actually, like, somebody hit me up. He was like, yo, this is my favorite song. I felt every word you said, and it was because of that. I grew up with no father line. Like, mm -hmm. somebody's gonna feel your song. Mm -hmm. You know, one thing in you that you say if you're talking about something real. Like, the truth is the best songs. Yeah, the pain, pain, yeah. pain sells, man. I think even even with that though, I feel like it's in a in a weird way. It's almost your duty to when you have that talent to be able to express it to the world even though it may be your inner most darkest thoughts and and parts of your life and things like that like justin said you never know who can relate to that you don't know yeah. who whose day you're helping get better by doing that and that's the beauty of art is that it's communication without being in the same room so i'm having a conversation with somebody who i've never met before through my music yeah and it's pretty fun. yeah it's fire it's crazy it's, it's crazy like so seeing people like I love what like people that don't know you support you hard. Anybody, bro, mm -hmm. they love you, they look up to you, they admire you, and that's a good feeling. Mm -hmm. So now you started making music in the math class. Yeah. Um, but that's when you started. When did you take it serious? Like, so I had went to Sudan like last year around December. 
my country, my home country, Sudan. Right. And Do you know where Sudan is? Right under Egypt, Middle East. Right under Egypt. I don't even know where the fuck Egypt is. Oh uh, shit, East, bro! North, North I know whoever, I know whoever Egypt was this man's social studies teacher high school? needs to be fired. How the fuck do I, do, do, do you know where Wyoming is on the, on the map? The fuck? What? Wyoming, though. Wyoming, you Do you know where it's at on the map? I know. What, Thank you. I, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I don't know. I, 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 I know where. I know where. I know where America is on the map. <laughs> do you know where Venezuela is on the map? Somewhere down there. Exactly. I, I just asked the question. I, just, I, just, I, I don't want to make sure we all on the same thing. How you not know where Egypt is? I know where Egypt is. I ain't know where. What you said? Where you? Where you from? Um, I'm Sudanese. Yeah, Egyptian. I don't know where Sudan is at. Like, is in Africa? Yeah. Oh, okay. So wow, just I've, yo, bro, I've been out of school for like over ten years, bro. So, Facts, Rick. Yeah, the most views come from pain. No, nah, it's a fact. real shit. But Ooh, yeah, so when do you take a How service? did that switch to me? That I just because he said he's from Sudan. I don't know. Do you know what Sudan is? No, what? you can't act them now after everybody yeah. said it. I, well, I'm just saying, I'm making sure we all on the same page. No, that we all okay. know that he's from Sudan. All right, well. Because most people may look at him, they don't think that you're from Africa, right? I didn't, man. I thought you were uh, yeah. They probably think like nah, he's a Dominican I'm, from like, the I'm South Cuban, France. Argentinian, Italian, and Sudanese and Egyptian. That's a lot of shit Damn, going on. Yeah, that's his own, that's his own alphabet. Did you take the um Ancestry. Yeah, you did that shit? Nah, not yet. My mom don't be jacking them. <laughs> I feel you. All right, so yeah, when you started taking it serious? Like last year, December, because I went to Sudan. I met my cousin. Like, I didn't meet my cousin. Like, I met him before. Mm -hmm. But this is the first time I, like, chopped it up with him, learned about him. And he actually, he was like, oh, yeah, I live in Toronto. I manage an artist. I make cover art. I'm like, what the Where you from originally again? Uh, I, I was born here. Born here? You don't have a New York accent. Yeah. See, nah. You have a New York it goes in and out. It goes yeah. in and out. Yeah, like, I did live in Sudan for Sudan, a good amount of time. But, yeah, where was I? So you went to Sudan, you met your cousin. Yeah, so I chopped it up with him, and he just, he was like, I'm going to manage you. Hmm. So he taught me a lot. He taught me the business side of things and how to, how to come at it with a plan, and how to schedule drops, drop dates, uh, Planning shit in advance, planning your Instagram. Like I have Instagram content for the next three months mm -hmm. on my notes. Check, 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 day by day. And yeah, it's just if you have a plan, it's like a blueprint. Like if you follow a plan, it's bound to work. Every time I post, I go up a follow, two follow, three follow. Every fan counts. Mm -hmm. It's gonna just little by little. It's a mm -hmm. grind. So, mm -hmm. how do you know when the plan is working? Because I think sometimes we could go on with a plan. Like Mike Tyson said, everybody could have a plan until they get punched in the face. Yeah. So, <laughs> and that's real shit. Um, but so when the plan is, how do you know when it's working? Because every time I see myself post, every time I, I see growth in, so, ev in everything, like my Instagram grows every day. I went up 40 followers in four days from my last music video. That's a good chunk of change. That's nothing, but. It's a chunk of change. That's nothing to some people, but it's that, that's, something. That's, 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 that's something. Like right now, I got like a thousand something followers. Maybe 400 of them is OFNY fans. Mm -hmm. The others is, oh, that's Omar. Mm -hmm. I need OFNY fans. So those 40 I just got, OFNY fans. And it just, just keeps going. What is OFNY? That's my, that's my uh, Omar from New York. It was just my Instagram oh, okay. name. Mm -hmm. And I was going to use it to rap. And then one day... Engineer was like, "Yo, you should just abbreviate it." I was like, "It's kind of nice." I was just told right here. I was just told right here that um, you should download this app called Planoli. Plan. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, you, yeah, could, yeah. you could, you could, you uh, could, uh, just put it up there and it'll post for you, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, facts, facts. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hey, he he has he has his shit ready. Nah, I mean, I, I think like first of all, the ability to plan at that age is just phenomenal. Mm -hmm. Like when I'm 17, I wasn't. My plan was to go to college. That was the only plan I had in life. So it was like to be able to plan your Instagram posts and all the other stuff and want to do it this, this way and know the business already. And you're already ahead of the, like I said, like he's the one that is different from the crowd. So right. it's like even saying all of that stuff doesn't shock me that he already knows that because he stands out from the crowd. But what I want to know, and I don't know if you have any questions. No, um, I have some. But um, what I want to know is, so I'm now you come back from, okay. So you come back from Sudan um, you have the game plan. Um, 
when I came back from Sudan, this is where I was at. I was just dropping my second song called Let Go. Mm-hmm. Right? Dropped my second song, put a little bit of money into it. That was the first song I put money into. Got like 40K on SoundCloud right now. Mm-hmm. And then I put it on Apple Music and Spotify and all platforms like a few months later. So numbers are a little off. But mm-hmm. then I started dropping. Like I, my drops were inconsistent then. Now I'm trying to get to two a month, one a month. Right. So I dropped Let Go. A few months later, I dropped like two months later, three months later, I dropped a song called Lifestyle. Um, Then Plum, then Rounds. But once I hit Rounds, that was like June. I recorded the music video for that. That was my first music video. Mm -hmm. That's when I started planning stuff in advance Mm -hmm. because I realized it's going to just, if I write it down and I have the content, it'll be easier. Okay. Do you um, mind if we um if we play one of your songs here? Yeah, we're gonna do oh, that yeah, later. We're gonna, we're gonna definitely do that. Later. Do that. Yeah, yeah. Um, does your plan have a time limit? Yeah, like where I want to be. I said goals, but it's no limit. Okay, as long yeah. as those goals get hit. Yeah, like there's certain times I want to hit those goals, but if it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen. I just keep it pushing. There's that's no setback on me. Mm-hmm. I'm not doing nothing Still wrong. Still moving. Yeah. Okay. So. What is what's the difference between Omar and O M F and Y? O F and Y. O F M Y. Yeah. What's the difference between Omar and O M F? O F and Y. Sorry, I got this side. Oh, all right. Omar from New York. O F and Y. O F and Y. What's the difference between them? Omar, he work at a supermarket. Okay. <laughs> he broke. He didn't doing nothing. Often, why? Often, why makes music? He's an artist. He's some for the people, entertainment figure. So, what's the message? What message are you trying to convey to the world? So far, the songs I drop, I have, I oh, haven't, yeah, I haven't had a message in the songs I drop so far because those are all old songs. But what I'm coming with now is, it's, it's a grind. It's a family. You gotta, you gotta do it with a team. You have to, you have to build. It's all about growth. Like that's, so, that's my message. It's growth. So what genre? Uh, it's like a hip hop music. Yeah, it's like so it's what kind like of genre? Melodic rap. Oh, okay. Like yeah, like melodic rap and stuff. So okay, cool, cool, cool. Mm. Just no, nah, go ahead, keep going. No, oh, I'm I, I, sure I, for seventeen too, man. That's yeah, what I'm word. saying. It's like like it's, I, I want to. Like, so um, it's like a different, like like a different world. Well, so that, I damn, told she wasn't like this in seventeen. Cousins is not the same. Like, shit, damn, she wasn't like this in seventeen. That's what I'm saying. Like yo, this this generation got it, man, and this is why I love them, bro. They, they're taking it serious and they're doing it at a young age. So now you're 17, you're working at the supermarket, you got your music going. Um, when are you looking to, like, what does the next step look like for you? The next step? Well, college, that's that's like a high school diploma nowadays. So that sounds like a must. But I feel like I want I do want to take a, a year off before starting college just to not rush into anything that I want to. on you. Yeah, focus on my craft, my dream for a year, and work, and then maybe get a better job. A job, though, not a, not something I'm gonna be for it long. There's a time limit on the job, mm-hmm. and if that year I, I go hard with music, hard putting money into every song, putting money into every video, and 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 just consistency. Um, I feel like, damn, I completely got off track. Sorry. Nah, you can, you <laughs> like talk about the what does the next the step next look like? Just trying to grow. Mm-hmm. Like just I, by March, I want to hit like three thousand followers on the gram, five thousand followers on the gram, maybe eight hundred likes, ten a thousand likes a post, and be able to hit views organically and build a mm-hmm. solid organic fan base. So I'm gonna try to ask this question the right way. Do you measure success? By numbers? No. How do you measure success? How people react mm. with it. So mm. what does okay. the likes on Instagram and, it's a good answer, and actually. all that mean to you then if you don't measure it by numbers? Because you can see that the growth. The the, the numbers on, on, on the song don't matter. Because just seeing growth like rounds and the video, I just dropped two different videos, two different responses. I, I, see, the thing is, I, actually, you, I you, agree with you. Yeah. Because... um. You we you might not see like there's only 15 viewers in here at this point in time, right? Yeah. But the views that we get and the comments we get and people 
that uh, I've been. You build a, a steady fan base. Right. And then I've been out, and somebody came up to me and was like, "Yo, yo, your shit is high. I've been, fo- I've been watching." That's nice. But they're not in this 15 right now. They're not in the 20 that come. They're not in the 30 that, that follow. Yeah, that yeah. Watch. But they go, yo, I've been watching. I'm yeah. Like, oh, word for real? He's like, yeah, I've been watching. Yeah. I get that all the time. Yeah. And that is, I don't care about the, I mean, not saying that I don't care about the viewers that are in here right yeah. now. No. But it still hits something. And it's the still eyes. Somebody. People, everybody going to see it, bro. Somebody's Somebody going to see it. Some- Listen, that's all about growth, too, because yeah. it's like, it's just, uh, it's development. You're basically building a fan base right now. Somebody's gonna tell another friend about it, and all of a sudden, mm-hmm. that's it. And before you know it, you have like you have like three thousand people watching, four thousand people watching. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? You just gotta find that right topic that hits the right crowd. Oh, you just gotta keep on moving. You gotta keep. Well, I mean, yeah, like, I'm saying, but I, I'm like, it's all it's all about grinding on it. You know what I'm saying, see, like you know, which is the which is the platform for it. You know? Yeah. Now, yeah, like we we've been out, and um, like I said, like I've had multiple people that. It doesn't reflect right now, but like you said, the numbers don't mean shit. Yeah, bro. Because it's like I, I didn't even know that four, five, six, seven, ten people came up to me. I was like, "Yo, I like it." I'm like, "Yeah, that makes me feel good." Yeah, bro. When somebody comes to me and says, "Yo, I've been watching you. Y'all, y'all doing your thing. I've been watching you. Yo, when can I come up there?" You know how many people have been asking us to come up here? It's just and and I didn't even know that they watch. Yeah. It's like it, that, that I I give it you on that. Yeah, I agree. Everything y'all said is right, but um, I don't want to all the way just dismiss the metrics. Like the metrics, oh, yeah, do yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, yeah, I'm not I do want to hit matter. certain goals. Yeah. yeah, but if the goals aren't hit, it's not, it's not because I'm doing something wrong. It's not a failure. It just yeah, hasn't exactly. happened yet. You so, j- you learn every yeah. time you post. So how do you feel about the word failure? Failure is needed. Why? Because that's the only way you grow. How the so? only way you get a lesson from it. Like you sure you're 17, bro? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this... <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so how so? Like like what is like so failure means that you learned a lesson? Like how like explain that? I post a song at a wrong time, it does bad because I posted it at the wrong time. Mm. Okay. Now I know I gotta post that this time. That's one little thing you learned. I have a friend that um actually raps. And um, he started posting things at a certain time, just like you, you said. You have to. But his, a lot of his fan base was from, came from overseas, and they did not awake at two yeah. o'clock in our time. Yeah. So he does it at a certain time where it hits both audiences, and yeah, that's the same like that. Like you got to know those shit too. You got to learn your audience mm-hmm. and learn who you're trying to make your own fans. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, yeah. That word. Are you, you sure you're 17? Yeah. <laughs> you see? You see? I got, a, I got another Listen, question. The way what he's you thinking is the way I started thinking when I was 28. This is what I'm saying, bro. <laughs> what do you say <laughs> to, to your man? I tell you. Let me ask you a question. What do you say to your man when you want him to be like, yo, I need you to start a podcast, but he's still sitting on the other side? <laughs> yeah, what you thought we forgot, nigga. <laughs> what do you say to that? Stage fright is a real thing. I, I feel him. I feel him. <laughs> That's what he said. He was. Jesus said that was him. He said that was. You gonna chop it up with him? Yeah, that's oh, okay. that's it. Oh, you can't I'm go on a pod. How you gonna do these meetings? Yeah. Meeting ain't no camera. Yeah, that's a fact. That's a fact. He's he's live right now. That shit's gonna be shown over. It says it's so. Rick said it's never a wrong time for music. And he said, most most of my fans are not on social media. Maybe it's because I rap for the streets. Mm. That's just his opinion. Go ahead, bro. I'm sorry. We can't oh, my bad. What would you say? I didn't even hear what you said. You want to say it on the mic? <laughs> <laughs> just had to ask. I don't know how to explain it, but what I'm saying is I like to talk. I like to have talk about my combos. Realistic shit. Shit that's going on right now. Everything is all. It's good to be involved and have your mind keep going instead of just you know what i mean it's good to interact it's good to talk to other random people like, I'll, like, I'll see some random person i'll have a whole combo in it. yeah that's that's why yeah. so you talk to red you so talk to me, random people during so like random. justin so yeah it sounds like me yeah <laughs> <laughs> all right so 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 let me let me ask you a question if 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 the camera wasn't here you come over here and talk to us He's talking to us now. Yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, I mean, no, no. He's good. He's good. I can hear. I can hear one of the headphones. Here, I mean, I'm pretty sure the people the can hear him. If the camera wasn't here, would you come over here and just chop it up? So act like the camera's not here and come chop it up. 
Just come over here, act like the camera's not here, just have a have a conversation. Some people just can't act like the camera. <laughs> it's all right. It's all right. It's all right. I was. Just, I'm just. I'm just. <laughs> I'm trying to I, listen, to everybody. I'm trying to. He said his man to his the podcast. Appreciate you, guy. No I'm doubt. Trying to get him on here. Appreciate, appreciate it, man. Appreciate well, it. I want to tell you guys, yeah, same thing he says for social blade. Huh? Social, social blade, blade, yeah, where they tell you like engagement rates on different pages. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Most definitely. Social content. Social blade.com. 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 Sorry, sorry, everybody. Let's get let's get back to it. Let's get back to it. Let's get back to it. All right. Um, another question I had was, what is Omar's life's purpose? Mm. To be honest, I got one goal in life. Like, I just want to be a good father. Like that. That's that's my. You have only. a kid? Nah. Oh, you want a kid? Nah. Like, I want a kid in life, but like, to be honest, like if if nothing falls through. The one thing I got to do is be a good dad. Like, that's the only thing I need to make me happy. Yo, this nigga, not nigga is 27, bro. <laughs> this nigga is, this I'll tell you right, right now. There's no <laughs> ID. Yo, where's your ID? Put out your fucking ID, man. This kid is not 17. Yo, it's 17, bro. What, what? That's 2003? <laughs> that's when he was born? Nah. It's July 19th. Oh, shit, I'm the 20th. Wow. That's crazy. That's crazy. Even though I don't know what none of that shit. Me either. I just say it. Word. The bitches like it though. Yeah, word. So what's? Like, oh, what are you? Yeah, I'm a cancer. cancer. They say, "Oh, you so sensitive." <laughs> <laughs> nah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. My fault. We can't talk to him about that. No. Yo, friend, <laughs> Yo, what yes up? you can. Friend, what up? Wait, 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 I don't wait, know. Wait. I'm just. I don't know. He might be 17, but. What's nah, nah, bro? See, he's legit. I, he is seventeen. I don't know. I don't know. Listen, listen. He doesn't look seventeen. Oh, he looks seventeen. He, he, he doesn't. Look 17, he, and he doesn't act seventeen. But I am seventeen. This, so, this thing is a crazy. scammer. <laughs> <laughs> so, man, we ain't so. What? Crazy. What's um, uh, OFNY's life's purpose? Yeah, to be one of the biggest artists and most influential artists ever. And how do you how do you define that? You change people's lives. But don't you, you think do. you're already doing it? I am. But also on the standpoint of where I could help my like my mother, like if I made it, made it, that's that's what OFNY wants to do. OFNY wants to make it on that Drake level, on that Gunner level, to where he could influence more people. I want to influence the world. Like influencing people is, is wonderful. Like I'm influencing as many people as I can. But influence in the world that's a different it's a different influence type of feeling. influence the world to do what just whatever they want to do i like i like people to follow their dreams want to do what they want to do don't that's don't deep. don't be don't 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 live to be a worker live to be you what's the difference working for somebody else and not working for yourself so do you feel like you want to so you want to be independent that's that's the goal that's the goal but yeah. you're also, i would sign a deal to be independent, like at the end of the day, but like when I first get up there, I would sign a deal, but I would, I would, this, it's not any deal I would take. Like I'd have to, I'd have to sit down and, and, and that's the side I really gotta learn. If we give you a deal right now, what you gonna say? Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> no, I gotta at least try. Gotta yeah, at least try. <laughs> let, me, let me see what we can get. Yeah, right got now. a three sixty deal right now. Three sixty right now. <laughs> So uh, now, so now you make it right. Uh -huh. Your influence in the world, but how do you know when you found happiness? I feel like I'm always gonna be happy. Like yeah, every day, a good day. You live and you. Do you pay in. bills? Nah. Oh, that, okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. So I'm saying you. Still, <laughs> you still you'll you'll learn. Breathing. You'll learn. Uh, it's, it's not that easy to find happiness once you start paying bills. I hear you. I'm I mean, listening. You have a happy. Yeah, I'm never mental, happy with though. bills, man. Hmm? You gotta have a happy man. Try to dodge my bills yeah. too. I'm, I'm, I always say, like, yo, I, fucking figure it out. Like, you, like okay. as long as I'm, I'm doing, as long as I'm not on the street homeless, I'm, I'm okay. doing better than a lot of people. Because I done been Africa. I'm seeing three year old kids with one leg walk up to me asking for money. Mm -hmm. With one leg? 
Yeah, one like what's up with this freaking like missing body parts in this like this podcast? <laughs> nah, the one the, the, the bitch with the nub was fire. Yeah, the bitch with the nub. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, <laughs> yeah, you missed that one. Oh, he was in uh, anyway. No, no, no. Hey, 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 we're gonna we gonna switch it back to music for him. Um yeah, what man. are you are you inspired by six nine? What? I don't, oh, even, I, don't gotta, I, gotta gotta the, I don't even get wow. Uh, uh, like inspired how like just like anyway. musically like, like anyway like musically a, business like what he, what he what he did I do think nah. he's a marketing genius or whoever okay. runs his marketing is a smart marketer because mm-hmm. he's taken this whole rap thing and embraced it and that's been better that's, for him because he would have fell off way quicker if he as came it, back he as a rapper right. instead uh, of a snitch. I mean, it doesn't matter if he didn't, so he made he he made money on that. He didn't yeah, sell, yeah, like money. he didn't make like, like a crazy amount of uh you know like hit like top ten Billboard and shit. Where but, is he? Huh? Where is he? He's not on the billboard. Well, he, where is he? Oh, he's around. I'm pretty he's sure he's somewhere. around. Somewhere he alive. He ain't making no money though. You know, he got his didn't blow up like he thought it would, but he made and some bread off of it. Big. He made more money than us right now. I'll tell you that much. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely more money than me. I work at a supermarket. That so we going back to that you question. You ever rapped about bagging up in the supermarket? Bagging up. Bagging up, mm. bitches. The supermarket. <laughs> nah, I did shoot a trailer in the supermarket. <laughs> Does your manager know that? I deleted that shit. I'm about to say. To be honest, I was like, "Damn, Some, somebody gonna tell on me. Like, somebody gonna just." Yeah, I deleted that shit. Oh, man. Man. No, I mean, that's what I was gonna tell him to do. I'm like, "Yo, you better delete that." I used that, that, that shit. I used that shit just for just for just for the drop day, and then because I needed some content. So musically, who do you go to for like inspiration? I listen to a lot of Tusi, but a lot of a lot I listen to a lot of my own friends too. But Tusi, he he his mannerisms and his, his charisma, like people fall in love with the the person, not the music. Who? Tusi, who's that? Yeah, nah. nah, I don't know who Tusi is. Who's that? Don't know Tusi nah, <laughs> nah, that's not <laughs> what? it. <laughs> Wait, what did he say? He said, "Y'all know Tusi Slide." Tusi, he's an artist. Two C like T O O S I I I. Oh no, S I I. You're about to look him up right now. He's a singer. You thinking about left front? Oh, right now. Two T two C two times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, I'm having. I'm having. I'm gonna listen. I'm gonna have to take a listen to this. If this this is what might who who inspires you? Yeah, he inspires me a good amount. To be honest, although you listen to him. He's yeah, he been out for, you just Googled like, him. I started listening to him like maybe like just now Googled last him. November. <laughs> Chris like, knows who he is. They said his album was fire. Never heard of him. Nah, I've been rapping since like yeah, last March. Two C. All right, cool. I'm gonna listen. I'm gonna listen to. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna listen. I'm gonna listen. What song from Two C made you want to rap? Uh. Oh, Made me run. Nah, I was already rapping before. He just likes it. That's his influence. Like, like na- it. like it, 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 it was a change. Like in the okay. beginning, I was like when I first started rapping, I was listening to to a lot of Pierre, a lot of a lot of Young Nudie, a lot of more. Yeah, I was just those two guys. Then it changed as I as I as I went on. My taste changed mm. as I changed. Like as a rapper, every time I would grow, I would. Can move we tell on. from your music how much you changed? <sighs> a lot, yeah, mm. yeah, like a I'm lot. To, so yeah. I'm have to, you're gonna have to. We're gonna have to drop a link and uh, tomorrow drop us a link, but put us to something that you did so everybody can listen to you. Yeah, we could, you. we gonna drop yeah, the YouTube link gonna, in we our gonna, chat. We're definitely gonna play a song tonight for, for sure. But uh, I want to. I want also you to drop like if you got like a. Like I got. A, you got I got. A, yeah, I got, I got a fan link. I just dropped something on Saturday, October thirty first. Um. Called hood ties. It's out on all platforms. YouTube Definitely music video. Oh, exactly. We're gonna play. Like we're gonna end, we're gonna end with that one today. Sounds good. Um, who's your top five rappers? All time. All time. All time. Who's your top five? You know it's crazy. I haven't even been listening to music that long. Mm-hmm. Like I started listening to music. Like, like I never used to walk around with headphones. Mm-hmm. Like that ass. Like sophomore year, I started listening. So, would you listen to the Prepare for Games? Like porn. Nah, son. I was just. It was more like. What are you doing, Step Bro? It was more like them, 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 them radio songs that you hear a lot. Oh, okay, okay. Gotcha. gotcha. Is this gonna bother you? Nah, Yo, bro. How you gonna smoke? I, I don't shit. smoke hookah. Bro, I don't like hookah. He just said he don't. 
Only... You're 17. Nah, bro. Nah, bro. You wildin', bro. You wildin', bro. You Cut wildin'. the podcast off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go somewhere with that, bro. What the fuck is wrong? Grown ass. It's Zay Fuss. <laughs> they gave it to me. And hey, you took it. What the what you mean? I've never asked for that. You didn't ask? All right, so now we just bold face line. Yeah, we got a seat for you. Yeah. Get on, get on, get on, get on. <laughs> Flip the camera. Uh, I feel you. I feel you. I'm not mad. Let me see. Um, He said, I want to hear. I got like, oh, yeah. So, yeah, the people want to hear. Who's your top five all time? Bro, to be honest, it's going to sound weird. Not, it, listen, there's no right or wrong answer. It's your top five. All right, so the people I've liked the most five. in my life that I've liked the most, like mm-hmm. that is going gonna, gonna to sound crazy. Tusi, probably one of my like, my favorite artists ever, number one. Okay. Fucking Pierre is crazy. Like he's... he's Pierre? Pierre okay. Bourne is like five, maybe four. Okay. Two. This is... Damn, this is difficult. <laughs> Go ahead. Take your time. Who do I... I, I, I how about Nelly? See, like these are people I never even I, 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 to, I, I, like. That. Somebody just commented. Like, Jay just commented. Nelly, know so classics like this is your top five. Crazy. It's not the people's top five. Nah, it's yeah, your I top know. five. Is it Eric Sermon? I don't even know who that is. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who that is. <laughs> All right, go ahead, go ahead. My bad. I'll, so I'll you said honest. Pierre Tusi, uh, Justin Rory, nice. Young Ka Nas. He said me, right? No. Yeah, facts. He said yeah, facts. Um, number three. Chavo, nice. Chavo, he's hard. Hey, Chavo is nice though. Chavo, Chavo's nice. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You li- you listen to him? Yeah, Chavo's nice. Word. Yeah. Yeah, he's mad unknown. That That's ass. crazy. He's one of Pierre's artists, actually. Oh, what? Yeah, but he's nice. You know who Pierre is? Pierre. Me? Born. No, I don't know. Nice. Hey, yo, Pierre, you want to come out here? Ah, okay. He raps too. I, f- I didn't just know. Known that. for his producing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. Oh, you got one more spot, huh? You got one more slot. Do I? Yeah, you got one more. You said Pierre. You said Tusi. You said oh, that's a lot of underground dudes. Tusi. Right? You said what was the dude, yeah, the producer? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, Are you okay? Hmm. I mean, if you want to talk. We here with you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, got you, got you, got you. Hmm. He got a lot of stuff to talk about. I'll tell you that right now, but we're going to talk to him behind the scenes. Behind the scenes, we're going to get him. And then we're going to figure out how to get him on here probably another time. But not right now. He's not ready right now. You know what's funny? That's dead true. I only know that because of that freestyle. What? The, um, the Pierre, da, 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 he says yeah. something because of the, um, what's the name of that freestyle that they did? That's when Zay was smoking the hookah. Oh, was, yeah. I'm about to play it. Yeah, it's not. It's not no, off the rip. It's um, what's the, what's the, what's the Oh name my god! You're not off yo. the hook, man. Who's number me. five? Huh? Me. You me. Five? There we go. Yeah. 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 Yo, nah, I'm that's number the, one. That's wait, the wait, cocky wait, arrogant so, New York that I'm talking I'm about. So, so, um, see, that's you freestyle. Can I put you on the spot? A little bit. Uh, I, I don't know about a freestyle. Man, that was a horrible yeah. beat <laughs> you just did right there. Oh my god! <laughs> How you was off beat on the beat? <laughs> That's crazy. That was crazy. Well, I'm tired. I'm trying to find the song. Uh, yeah, I know Rich, I got the that... video in my head. No, I don't want nobody to tell me because I want. I to just. Zay, what's to, the name of that song? It. They go. Dun, oh, Magnolia. Dun. Magnolia. There you go. Magnolia. There you oh. go. Oh damn! Yeah, Rick just said it. I was. I wasn't trying to get a handout. You know, I'm not. A, I'm not a um, Democrat. Even... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's talking about the producer, but he said he raps too. That's. I didn't even know that. He I do. just thought. He's nice. nice. That's crazy. Yeah. I have no idea of like anybody you said. Uh, nah, I, listen, to, I, don't have, I don't listen to a lot of like I don't like, like mainstream just because they get played out once they make it a lot oh, of times. Already, every fucking yeah. second you turn around I feel radio, like on people scene. I don't hear so much you like to to. better. And people people that are up, they start rapping about the same thing that got them up. I wanna hear variety and Shit like that. Yeah. I mean, I agree with you. I, I play I some Chavo. I don't even know who that is either. He had a song called Michigan you should play. Uh, Michigan? Michigan. Oh, yeah. Michigan. Michigan, is fire. Michigan was all right. Michigan, I, I, didn't, I, I, they, didn't they fuck up your man Trump's ballots? You want right, to Come on, listen. I'm talking about fucking I'm oh, talking I, I, Chavo, man. Fuck, you got to bring up politics right, now, my man. Fault, my fault, my fault, my fault. I'm sorry. MAGA, baby. MAGA. 
<laughs> so, Maggie, are you into politics? I'm not. No. All right, cool. not we keep that, that out of here. We keep that out of here. What does what does uh Omar do for fun? Me, rap. Uh, yeah, to be honest, that's it. Like, I play ball occasionally, but it got cold, so that's a dub. Mm. Uh, I just hang out with my friends and talk about how we gonna do something. Good, man. Good, good. Do you I feel? Mean, Go ahead. No, 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 I just, just want to give you a quick breakdown of this shit. Um, me and JT spoke about this shit for maybe about, let me say, like two years. Mm-hmm. It was a, it was a, yo, let's do it, let's do it, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm waiting for you, I'm waiting for you, I'm waiting for you, I'm waiting for you, waiting for you right? Until one day we just did it. Yeah, word. To be honest, just, you just gotta go. So. Like you talk to your friends and you're like, yo, I want to do this, I want to do this, I want to do this, but you just gotta take that step. Yeah. You you gotta you gotta take that step. I was just telling him that over there. Like you gotta keep it moving. You don't ever Word. know what's gonna happen. You just gotta keep it moving. So if you over there talking to your friends, you're like, yo, I'm a rap. I need you to do what you said he gonna Word. do. I need you to do this, that's that. Let's let's make this. Word. Like there's no better time for us to do this together, right? Now. Word, bro. It's because there ain't shit for us to do. If if we can't talk about Making something out of ourselves, making some type of money, uh, making a difference. And what, and can what the we fuck? T- yeah, we what can we talk about? Like, we need to be doing something. We need to be better in each other. Uh, yeah, if that's your man's, yeah. yeah. But if that's not, then you need him around. <sighs> it's a hard combo. It's... You gonna put me? You gonna try to separate the group? Like, what's up <laughs> with you, bro? Like, what's, nah, your, what's, nah, your, nah. what's your vibe? It, it is definitely people I know. Do you need them around if they, ain't, if they ain't trying to help you build your future? I'm trying to build our future. So if they're not trying to build a future, like, n- no homo, together. Nah, then, that, ain't, that ain't gay, man. Then, then like, how, what you going to do? And that's Can't, you sucking you ain't gonna build it by your, yeah, you, you ain't going to build it by yourself, and I'm not going to build it by myself. I'm exactly. going to do it with a group of people. If you're in that group, then you part of that group. But if you don't, if you're not willing to do what it takes to... Yeah, work at as a unit, then mm-hmm. we gotta go. What are we missing? Are we missing something? Nah, I'm trying to get these uh the comments stop working for whatever reason. So, so I just gotta group refresh it. Huh? You got a group. That happens. All right, go ahead. There we go. Say that again. No, I'm asking him like basically if um if uh he comes up with the group, but they wind up only wanting to sign him, but not sign the group. What are you going to do? If they want to sign me and not sign the group, I got to still be able to provide for the, like, not provide for the group, but I still got to be able to make room be for around error. them. Make room for error for yeah. them, yeah. Yeah, okay. I got to still be able to be around them and be able to work. That's got to be like, able well, to be um, my team. Like how J-Rock and Kendrick Lamar was doing. Yeah, like, yeah. like J-, J-, J. Cole got Dreamville. That's... No, J Rock. J Rock. Yeah, I'm saying. Oh, I was just oh, yeah. switching. But I feel you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying like J Cole got we got Dreamville with 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 Boss mm-hmm. and and a bunch of rappers and they all play their role and they're a group. Like if somebody wants to sign J Cole, he's still got to be able to work with his Dream, group. Make Dreamville. Sure Dreamville's good. Yeah. yeah. I, J Cole's my favorite rapper. So that's who I actually like. When I first started listening to music, I was listening to him a lot. But then my taste changed. What was what started your like? What started your influence into rapping? My friends was rapping. That's it. Yeah, and I like they song. Okay, I was like, yeah, it was like, it was like, oh, this it's is nice. It's not nothing, nothing. Know, it's but... pretty rare for like uh, guys like um, people in for the neighborhood songs. I mean, it's just like without a fan base. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? It's pretty mm-hmm. rare for that to happen. What do you mean? So now I'm saying like like if you uh. If it's just you, like like your guys, but they don't have a fan base, it's pretty rare for people to like the guy's song because usually it's like you always find something like a glitchy of the song. Yeah, and, you know, it's like it's just like it's just like a natural thing. Okay, I'm still confused. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm still confused. Okay, like, oh, okay. What uh, all right. Yeah, what he's saying? I feel like he's saying like it, there needs to be proof of demand. Like people won't like a post because it doesn't have likes. They, but they like they'll like the post in their head. They'll be like, "Oh, this is nice." Is that considered hate? Nah, it's just consider. It's just how people are, are, are. It's just how people are. People like like literally look at your page for hours and love what's on your page and not follow you because you don't have ten thousand followers. Mm-hmm. It's called proof of demand. Mm-hmm. If people see that 
you're 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 wanted, then they're gonna want you. That makes sense. Isn't that more for like 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 outside? Yeah, that's for more strangers. No, no, but his friends, but his people that are like that too, they think he's your friends, but they really. Oh not. yeah, people won't jam, you, bump your music, but I bump everybody's music in my friend group because niggas is nice. Um, so I don't fall into the category. Yeah, Jay Z, Sean, the light. Wasn't you? I wouldn't. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't let. let I, like I wouldn't let them do that. I would be like, yo, I don't like this song. Make another song. I'll let you know if it's. Would you tell your friend if he sucks? If he sucks at making music, yeah. yeah. Has any of your friends ever said that to you? Nah. Even when you first started? No, like, well, no, 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 no. They've nah, never I'm told saying, me. Let's they, start telling some truths now. They never right. told me I <laughs> suck. They never told me I suck, but like, because the first song I recorded in the studio, it sounded good. Okay. But there was a lot of struggles in the studio, a lot of wasted time, a lot of wasted hours, a lot of wasted money where I made bad songs and my friend, yo, this shit is ass. This shit sucks. Hey, that's a good friend. That's who I take to the studio with me. Is he a good time. friend or is he a hater? Is nah, it, is it really not a good at song? all a hater. I want you to tell me. Really I song? want you to tell me. That I feel like I'm a. a I feel like I, I, I'm a good critic of do, myself. Do you still I have the song? Huh? Do you still nah, have the song? I don't. I, I deleted that shit because I didn't like it myself. How do you know if it was in, if it was any good? Because I feel like I'm a good critic of what sounds good, and like I feel like I, I'm a. I, I know what sounds good, and I feel like I know. Like I feel like I'm a good judge. Like I'm not. I'm not biased towards myself. I feel like I know what somebody could listen to and what's unbearable. Mm. Who is the dream artist that you want to work with? Like, who do you want to be in the booth with? Besides us, because you came on our shit. I mean, yeah, like, yeah, as long as we don't, as long as we don't forget first, that. First, uh, first, first podcast. podcast. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, we got. Oh, you got an artist right here. <laughs> you got an artist right here. Oh, my fault. My, my fault. bad. Back to the streets, November thirteenth. Yeah, there we go. Pre-save Pre-save link. November thirteenth. Huh? Pre-save link. Yeah. Hit, <laughs> hit track. Yeah. His hit is called Eight Days. Eight days. Mm. Eight days. Track six got deleted. Yeah, track, track six, six got deleted. Yeah. Scandal. Yeah. Scandal. Yeah. Who, who, who is like the one person you want to work with? I do really want to get in the booth with Tusi. Like, like Tusi. Yeah, I, I gotta listen to some Tusi. Huh? We gotta make that happen. I don't. Yeah, I, don't right. I don't think that's out of like the realm of possibility. That, like, nah, we got everybody. Everybody. I want y'all to when that when listen. And we're gonna bump this shit today for the rest of the week. We're gonna try to get him a feature with Tusi. We're gonna just throw two. The throw song his name I just dropped Tusi. ain't ain't worthy of a feature. Yeah, we, we don't know that yet. We I'm gonna... telling you, it's, it's it's not out of the realm of possibility. It's never, oh nah, hell no. no! I got it. Should be like three bands. That's what I'm saying. That's it. Yeah, but it definitely went up. It's probably like five, ten now. I don't, I don't think that's out of the realm of possibility. Not at all. We're going to make that shit work, man. You think we, we can raise up. some funds for that? But I, nah, I, I'd rather I'd rather work with the artist because... Yeah. Nah, nah, that's not happening. What you going to call it? You found him? Yeah, that's yeah. him right there. All right, we, we going right, to right, spam I, I wouldn't. Soon. I wouldn't want to pay for a feature right now. Why not? Because I, I want to have that proof of demand. I want to be able to build a... I want to be able to build a relationship with him, artist to artist, not, not somebody. Oh, he's just paying me for this. And he's he's a business guy. He and wants to. I I got to be able to help him, and he's got to be able to help me. You don't want him to just come and say this shit, throw some oh, whack nah, curse on your shit. He's from uh, North Carolina. Like he was born in Syracuse, it's and then it's I think it's North it's Carolina. I'm. I got to remember that shit. Love cycle. Love cycle. Oh yeah. Where he's basically having sex so with that shit. You like him? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. His videos be porn, I swear to God. Just send you his Instagram. Instagram. All right, send me that. We're we going to spam Tusi. Uh, yeah, he said we're going to spam Tusi. We're going to spam Tusi. That's what you want. We're going to try to make that We're going to get bots on him. We're going to get some bots on him. What happened? Look, look. We're going to get bots on Tusi. Like Rick said, we, sometimes you got to make that investment, man. You gotta yeah, nah, you definitely, there's definitely investments you have to make, but I feel like with the fan base I have right now, I can't, no, I can't, I, I, I wouldn't want to do it right now. I got to build on my own. You understand that. Your fan base, he has a totally different fan base. He puts it out, your song or him song. You know his fan base comes to your fan base, and now you they come you see a lot of people more see your shit. Exactly, but I'm not at that the level of my content, my discography that's out. My discography is like all the songs I have out is not at a level that I feel like I would have like a conversion rate to a fan. I feel like in a few months when I have these really good recent songs that I've been working on. Then I convert somebody but, into a fan. But I also feel like you shouldn't sell yourself short. I'm Don't not. Feel like somebody 
is not gonna hear your shit and like your shit because of what the past is. Like you still got somebody could come in right now and and be your fan for now until I have fans from right now. I'm saying that I'll definitely get fans from a feature if I do it with a feature with Tusi right now. But would I get the same growth from that same feature if months, I had months down the line? Yeah, if I had better songs out, better videos out. Nah, it would be a way higher conversion rate. Okay. That's fair. He, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. He, yeah. yeah. Okay. Rick said, look at me goes with Drake. Oh, yeah, nah, if you pay for a feature, I, I, I feel like when, I, when, I, when I'm at the point to pay for that feature, like I would pay for a feature with him. But when I'm at the point that I know I'm ready to pay for that feature, I want to feel like I'm able to make a connection where I wouldn't have to pay for it again. Mm. Mm. So the, now this question is, have um, have you found, like, has he 100% found his fan base or is he still finding his fan base and still finding his voice? Mm. Definitely still finding my voice. So it's 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 getting better. Like it, it, the word I like to use when finding your voice is like effortless. When it's effortless to record a song and you know how you're gonna come on, it's getting there. That's for me. Like I, I I'm learning my voice and it's 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 getting to where it's effortless. It's almost there, but it's not there yet. Okay. Because there's still mistakes made and there's always gonna be mistakes made in the future. But what do I have to type into YouTube to find your music? Oh, FNY. Let's see. I just want to see by itself. That's 04 and why. <laughs> oh, that was funny, nigga. Yeah. Was, <laughs> you still put 04. What do you mean? O F. That's 04 again. You didn't even drink. Yeah, I'm tired. It's been a long day. Let's see. That one. There you go. Good times. Is that the one? Uh... That's the one that you just dropped. Yeah. I'm, right, what's cool. it at? So, I'm gonna I'm just put it up so that people can see it. Yeah, now nah, so we about to it's um it's it's already twelve something, bro. We got that. It's twelve already? Yeah, we got to wrap it up. Oh, oh shit. So right. um matter of fact, we're gonna play yeah, you gotta this. Get home. Oh wait, before we get into that, um I see KJ in the building. Shout out to KJ. We gotta get you on here too, bro. Cause I know you making you making good music. Do y'all do y'all have a song together? Not yet, bro. Not yet? It's gotta happen. I'm about to say, like y'all should already Yo, you heard it him, right? It gotta, it gotta happen. Yeah, it like, we, gotta, happen. we gotta make that happen. We gotta make that happen. We gotta make that happen. It's definitely gonna happen. Though. Okay, right, cool. let's see. Um, well, you should hold on, hold on, hold on. Well, you should freestyle every day. That's what he did to find to find voice. I I I I, 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 I like the lines and just lines throughout the day, but I haven't like got to the point where I could freestyle for if I put a beat on bars at a time. I don't I, like. I could get a good. I could get great flow. I could get I could get a plan for a track, but I can't I can't freestyle for maybe sixteen. Okay, I don't think I could. Respect it. Yeah, word. But listen, it was. Uh, you got anything else, man? Oh, see? so he's over there saying you can't. See, that's, see, that's, see. That's, that's, Selling oh! yourself short, man. Selling yourself nah. short. See, come on, man. You got me a little bit more confident. You got it. If you he got it, so we put a beat on right now. You ready? Nah. <laughs> Yo, Kev, you got anything else for him? Nah, man. He's... You got anything for us? Yeah, word. Real quick before we go, what's y'all? What's y'all vision with this? Where do y'all want to be? That's a good question. Want to take it? No, I got. I got. I got. Well, I think I. I I think we have two different visions and the same goal. Okay. Uh, my vision is I have children. Mm -hmm. Mine is generational wealth. I think I know that's his too with his family and everything like that. And um, if it was up to me, this would be a whole family type of music, podcast, everything in one. Mm -hmm. Um. This is a podcast right now. This is not where we we end in. We're gonna continue. We're gonna make mm -hmm. other stuff like that. Um, in music, clothing, whatever it is, this is just a platform where we can do every every type of thing. Like I, I want to be able to bring you on here, and you have millions of people saying, "Listen to me, this shit." You know what I mean? This is that's that that is Word. my goal to, to make this as big as possible. Yeah, and for my kids and my kids' kids to understand that they have a spot where they they work in, 
under us and they have mm-hmm. they have generational wealth. Word. That that's that's the goal. My, yeah, that's yeah. my goal to make sure that my family and my kids and everything is is set for the future. Yeah, you want to break the chain of mediocrity. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, I'm mean, let's just let me just throw this out there. People might think this is fun. This is fucking amazing. This is great. Yeah. This is work. You don't. Yeah. Yeah. Like, everything's a scenes, job. Like if if you really taking it serious, got to do just it's to a, do it's a this. job. Like we up all night. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes we up until two, three in the morning for like four days straight trying to work on getting shit done. Word. It's fun. It's therapeutic. But this is a job. And yeah. We fucking look at him. He's tired. Yeah. He works too. He works another job. I came here right after my shift at the supermarket. Oh. Mm-hmm. oh. Bagging. Exactly. <laughs> but bagging everything. Bagging groceries, bagging bitches. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> but but my, my shit. You just said bagging. Thing, you know. <laughs> oh shit. You see but me. My, my whole shit with this is generational growth, making us something better, giving us a platform for people where we can just all grow together. I think we similar, but I thought he has some different different mindset. That's what makes us work. Word. What's yours? Um, I mean, yeah, pretty much everything you said, building a platform, um, but also using this platform to it's kind of like to what you were saying is to have influence, mm-hmm. um, to be able to show that like there's positivities <laughs> of being in the Bronx, being in growing up in the projects, like people already have their preconceived notions of what people from the Bronx are like, what people are from New York are like, and and we're we're here to change that. I think I my vision is this just to be a part of the culture. A consistent part of the culture and uh, we're already doing that now it's just taking that and doing that on a massive level also building a platform that could just be passed down like like he has he has children i don't have children yet but when i do have them i want to be able to have be in a position to where they don't have to go asking somebody else for a job they could just we could just put them on payroll exactly your job could be to come in the studio have everything set up before we get here that's a job that's um, exactly what I meant by creating roles. Exactly, creating mm-hmm. roles. Exactly what you were saying. So that's what um, that's part of my vision for what we want to use this platform for, like just to be influential for the culture, and then to be able to build that generational wealth to where um, our children and the and the people in our community have a place where they could go. They just just to talk, to get mm-hmm. to be able to get stuff off their chest, ra- raise awareness for anything, um, talk about their music, talk about their art, talk about their day, like. We don't have a we we can't just go to News Twelve and yo let's let's just let's just talk and let it be broadcasted all over the world, like we don't have that. So yeah. we're building that platform here, exactly. where anybody could come on here and anybody could have that platform of. Um, I just want to be able to to speak my piece and be able to influence and and build my build my my following, and also like I was saying, just generational wealth, sum it all up. Yeah, it's a big goal. Yeah, separate ourselves. I just need to get some generational wealth. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, but that's it. And and, and in the long run, it'll too. come. It'll come. Word. As long as you, as long as you hustle for what you strut on, what you want. Word. That was on the long run. I, I like. I'm I'm thinking future, future, future. I would like chapters of this. I would like a a recording studio. This is like this series that we in right now. I want this. I want us to, to be own yours. Something like this. Yeah. I don't want. I, I, I don't want. I don't want us ever to to be like yo. Now nah, this is our shit. Yeah, this is this is our shit. We do our shit in our own place. We do all that shit. Like, eventually, that's gonna. This come. is my empire. Yeah, this and uh, and and I've said this plenty of times before. Like, um, some some people might un- might not understand like that the views that we get and everything like that, the likes and the comments and the people telling us shit. They, yeah, that might not seem like a lot to you guys, but it's it's it means the world to me. Facts, you know, and and like. Just, just growing every fucking day is like, it's the best feeling I've ever had in my life. And it, and as long as you love it and you continue, and 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 you can just keep moving, yeah, and have fun. Like this, this is a job, but it doesn't feel like a job. It feels like fun. Yeah, because you like doing what you. Because I like, I like being here talking to you guys. I like being here just chopping it up. I like doing all that shit. But it's time. Mm-hmm. Just keep keep your head into the same spot and just keep going. As long as you invest in your time into something that you like, it's not yeah. no time wasted. Yep. Yeah. That's like that's like when dudes retire, like say in the basketball, like yo, when you gonna retire? When it's not fun to me no more. Now, this yeah. shit is fucking fun. Facts. Like I I, I love I love it. I love coming here. Th- Thursday yeah. is my favorite time of the, the week. Yeah. Because I come here and I, I'm with my guys and we talking about. Sometimes we sometimes we have really heartfelt conversations. 
Sometimes we talk. I know y'all, y'all came in in a little little spot where we Yo. was going crazy. Yeah, but get, I heard get, something. No, something. We go. Dudes licking their own. Uh, yeah, that was crazy. Yeah, was yeah, crazy. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, I mean, it's the, the, future, the, the future. You you don't know what the future holds. And and we're going we gonna to continue. We're going to try. And there's nobody going to stop us. Started a whole fucking business. We started a whole, like, it. everything in here is legit, like. We didn't. We we didn't even have plans for that immediately. Like we didn't. That shit grew so fast. We had to do it. Yeah. Like we had to do it because if something wasn't happen, we could have got. We could have got fucked. Mm. You never know, man. Just keep it moving. Y'all doing your thing. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Doing great. Yeah, man. Appreciate and it. and just Appreciate understand it. that you always got our support. Like mm-hmm. no matter what, if anytime you want to come on in here, that we're here. You too. You want to come on here, bro? You ever want to get on camera? Or even, even, we don't even... We could just do an audio podcast if you ever want to do that. I mean, so like this... Go. Oh, now he would it. Yeah, yeah like... Now, told, yes, sir. I told him we go, we go, now, I can't see what's going on. All that. the comments. Damn. I hope... Mm, kind of. No, no, no. Yeah, this episode is full of cutoffs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, it's all right. We're good, though. But, man, sorry. We had to, we had to, we couldn't see the comments, so we had to, we had to go in and out. But, uh, yeah, man, I told him over there. I said, yo, we're going to talk. You got to make that step. You taking a big step. Now, maybe, maybe you said that's the man, right? That's the podcast man, right? <laughs> Right? I never that's, said that's what that's he has to do. Hey, 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 I said, said that's what he should do, and actually, he should explore so it, see you know if he likes do? it. Sometimes you got to give him that push. Yeah. Trig just Next said, time, um, Trig said he listened to, um, I said we had a seat, but I don't want to force him to do nothing. That's where I'm, I, that's where I'm I stepping out of my room. Just have him to sit around yeah. for a couple of, you know what I'm saying? Just, you know, just you know, talking this shit. Yeah. And then eventually put a camera. Yeah, exactly. You know it's yeah, it, it day by day. Listen, listen, listen. How he's 17 also? Nah, he 21. 21? Met him at my job. Met him at your job? Yeah. Listen, it's, it's all part of the game. If you're gonna be, if you're gonna be with him and during the game, fuck your charger, bro. It's it's all part of it. It's all part of it. Yeah, just man. Gotta, anything like, else you gotta access? Like, like not give a mean? fuck anymore. Uh, wait, hold on. Uh, Trig said he did listen to Hood Ties. He said that he Trig, um, one of the guys. He said that uh, he could definitely tell that you like Tusi. Um, and he said it's a good song. Oh, that was even before, I recorded that before I even listened to Tusi. Hey, yeah, that's I recorded crazy. that last year, October. Oh, that's that's how old the song is. Like that's why <laughs> that's why I say because by the time I drop a song, I don't like the song because I've made so much more content that that I've seen the growth. You feel like already. you developed. Yeah, I already seen the growth. So the songs that I wrote yesterday is gonna be better than the songs I drop tomorrow. It's just it's just you're gonna see something that I write today, maybe in three months. That's fair. I'm just reading this. I'm reading the comments. Yeah, what is that? I can't. It said, um, I don't what know much about music. Know? I can listen and take uh, from Justin. I know culture and society. I can listen uh, and break uh, bread with JT. Buy one and get two podcasts. Mm. Respect it. We need an engineer. Right. Yeah. We need Omar. you to come back to the podcast. Nah, nah, nah. Zay, Zay already took his spot. Oh, Zay took his spot? It's over? Uh, he says, <laughs> I really want to see the other guy. He's scared for no reason. It's all love and support. Listen, you already got somebody supporting you already. Uh, he's not scared. He's not scared. He's just not ready. No, nah, it's cool. It's cool. Yeah, it's cool. You're getting ready. green hearts from the ladies. Come yeah, on, bro. Like, come on, man. So, look, next time. Next time. Like I said. Even, That's the mystery, man. You don't want to be on camera. We can mystery do man. You, you hear him, but you can't see him. Mystery man. Bet. 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 We can do that. We can do that. We set it up. We set something up. But, um. Nah, nah. not. Or this shit had me nervous when it's, I first walked in. <laughs> it's all right. It's all right. <laughs> Listen, I mean, I, I, I said it to me. We had uh, other people on this before. We did it. And I just want you to understand that. <laughs> <laughs> you say, uh, how okay, you can. Right. <laughs> but like, I'm going to say, we're not professionals. Yeah. Like, I, I just want you to understand, like, we get nervous too. Yeah. Like, it's not like we, we here and we've been doing it. For our whole life, like we yeah. we we learning, you learning on we the job. Learning on the, we learning on the fly, like that's the best way to learn. Same way you learning, you making, you getting yourself better. Mm-hmm. Every every week, we get better. Exactly, 
Every song every, you're gonna get every better. Every get better. podcast is every gonna podcast be a better topic. Gonna get better. Yep, yep, yep. And, and, and every every topic we're gonna get better. We're gonna figure out how to bring make you better. Yeah. You're gonna figure out how to make him better. Yeah. That's what it is. And that's why the numbers <laughs> don't matter as much as the growth. I'm sorry, war is killing me uh, with the comments. <laughs> but uh, but but it's it's that's what it is. It's like just want you to put that out there to you. Like it's it's okay. Like because we don't know what the fuck we're doing all the way. We're yeah. trying it. And it's the best thing to make our failures now. We're going to fail eventually because mm-hmm. we ain't failed yet. But eventually it's going to happen. And we're going to pick ourselves up and keep it moving. And we're going to do it. And we're going to keep on doing it. And there's, there's, no, there's no end in sight. So we're going we're gonna to do it in the same way with you. You're going to have a bad song. We're going to have a bad podcast. We're going to have... Our sure. first podcast is sound like shit. Yeah, I got songs out that I don't even like. Yeah, that's right. It's 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 gonna happen and and it's only up from here. It's, exactly. You've been you hit you already been down, so just keep it up. Yeah, word. The only way is up. Yep. And kind of what you were saying earlier, like there's no such thing as failure. It's it's not losses, it's lessons. Word. It's all about perspective. Did you learn something from the experience? Did you learn something from that failure? If you didn't, then yeah, that's a loss and it's a failure. But if you take away something from that, it's a win. It's always a win. It's about moving forward. It's about falling forward. Yeah. Not falling backward. Falling forward. You're gonna trip. You're gonna stumble. Fall forward. Mess up. Fall forward. Learn from it. Fall forward again. Learn from that. So that way you don't stop fumbling and looking crazy. Mm-hmm. Then you get yourself together, and then now you're not fa- now you're not uh, stumbling. Now you're walking. And you now go from, from walking to running. Then now you're running to sprinting. And now you just you just took over. At can't that stop. Can't stop. The train can't stop. Can't stop. Mm-hmm. Um. So I right, let's close out then. Yeah, let's close, close out. out. Um. We gonna we just. You you want a song you gotta play? Cause I just want to end it with him. Yeah, no, I got I got a song. Um, somebody said my boy. I don't know who this is. Click your name at the top so we can see your comments. Facebook, you probably see it if you go on it. Yeah. Uh. But, All right, so um, I got hood ties. This is the newest one. You want to introduce the record? Yeah, that's hood ties. Like I said, recorded that last year October. A lot of new stuff coming, but enjoy it while you got it. There we go. Where can they find you? Mm-hmm. I'm on all platforms, OFNY, all caps, OFNY, everywhere. Apple Music. I'm on Spotify. Apple. I'm on Napster, bro. What? Yeah. <laughs> That's Damn, I, have, hustle. I haven't heard of Napster in years. <laughs> Are you on LimeWire? I'm on everything. LimeWire. Hey, <laughs> Napster is like Winamax. It's like Winamax and their share. Frost Audio Wire. Mac. Audio Mac. Audio, Audio Mac, Mac Audio and Gamway. I used to download mad porn. My Amazon phone. Music. My fault. We got that. He's 17, <laughs> that's bro. Right, I know. That's why I had to stop myself. That's why. We good. We good. Dragon Anything Ball. you want to um mention about the download video before Dragon we play? Ball. It's a great video. All right. My all right. Are... Everybody go follow <laughs> OFNY man, on all platforms. This is his newest video, Hood Ties. Appreciate y'all tuning in. <laughs> Like I'm married, then I'm Jay-Z, you know the price tag Baby, see me doing good shit, want me in my life now Riding with them killers, you can't step into our lifestyle Niggas pulling triggers, we gon' show that nigga lifestyle Bitches fucking with us, they gon' come, they gon' go Niggas flipping switches, they gon' fly, they gon' fall Focus on this chicken, turn the squad, kick the wrong If you messin' with my niggas, we gon' put you in the floor Messing with my guys who really got you smoked up People say we wild cause they know that they can't hold us Oh my bro, he's stepping in, you know that we stay pulled up A lot of people sleeping, so it's time that they don't woke up Running every day, so it's about time that I don't blow up Jacking at you like that, but you ain't never gon' show us I'ma come correct you, you know that I'm gonna show up Got a hundred different flows, I think it's about time I go blow up Now I got my hundreds up, my pockets full of blow He didn't see me up and they ain't know what to do Starting off in four Dripping down to the show Trying to make a honey Can't wait Mess around and buy a coat Baby, I should sit this way For my necklace Drip at the door Does I know I'd be dressing What I want is cash Can't see nothing Learn like my lesson Niggas acting funny And that's why I keep a lesson Keep them on their toes Yeah, you gotta keep them guessing Racing to the top I can knock them in second Whole lot of drip Yeah, you know I'll be out here flexing When it comes to cash No, I got time to invest in Louis Gucci, from Fanny to Prada Drippin' too hard, yeah, my fit posting commas Can't fuck with no bitches, can't fuck with no drama Just stay in your lane and 
and just stack up your dollars. Cause niggas gon' hate, but when you leave, they gon' follow. If you want beef, all my niggas got hollow. So stay by yourself, cause you dead, don't want problems. My niggas to pros, yeah, they clutching the rockets. Whole lot of blow, I've been flooding my pockets. But no, 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 I can't stop it. Don't talk about money, I ain't fucking with the nonsense. My niggas gon' blow up, just trust in the process. Might get married, then I'm just, you know the price tag Baby, see me doing good shit, won't be in my life now Riding with them killers, you can't step into our lifestyle Niggas pulling triggers, we gon' show that nigga lights up Bitches fucking with us, they gon' call and they gon' go Niggas flipping switches, they gon' flop, they gon' flow Focus on this trick and too much grab, can't go wrong If you messin' with my niggas, we gon' put you in the floor Uh, Zara's, 60 Cash, rolling on the budget. Uh, Got our own merch. Come on, pop up. Rich Thoughts. Come on. Black Fazos. <laughs> Black Fazos. Black Fazos. <laughs> All right, man. Listen, I, I like that. It was good. It was good. It was good, man. Thank you. Thank um, you. Everybody, listen, go follow him. Uh, what is your Instagram? Right Omar here. Omar from NY, right uh, there. Omar from Omar NY, from everybody. NY. Omar from NY. A.K.A. O O F N Y N Y Omar. Yeah, don't mess it up again, bro. You messed it. You put listen, listen. We passed that. My mom's messing that shit up. Don't mess it up again. Listen. O four. Uh, yo, I wanna. What's your man's name over there? Yasin. Yasin. Yasin, but y'all ain't seen him because he ain't come on the pod. Listen. Yo, thanks, Kev, for coming on here. Trumpinator Zay over there, man. He's a. He's still there. He's still chilling. Yasin, we here. Uh, OFNY, thank you, man, for coming on, talking to us, whatever course, like that. You know, we to be here. here. Uh, remember, your nine to f- uh, your nine to five pays your bills. Your six to twelve builds your empire, man. And you know what you're doing? We building this fucking empire, man. Exactly. This is what we doing. We gonna build this shit. You gonna build from your ground, shit from the ground we gonna up. Make him build his shit. He go- he's building some shit that we ain't even talking about. We trying to get in that shit. Everybody building, man. We gonna do this shit. And it's gonna it's it's already actually established. We got a we got a first employee on Wednesday. All right, nice yes, good job, you, man. Bro, so. But listen, we're gonna do this shit. We love y'all. We out of here. We ending it with him. Uh it's only right that we keep his his song on there. And got um, another one. We got one more. Got one oh, more. It's old. It's old. Oh, you it's don't want old. this one? Nah, I don't care. I'll oh, play okay. whatever you want. All right, we gonna close out to this. Which one is this? What's this called? Rounds? Rounds, yeah. We're gonna end it one more with rounds. This is rounds, fellas. This is round. Everybody, man, we love y'all. We out of here. You niggas is not on my level. Like shadows, my foot on the pedal. Don't talk if it ain't by the cheddar. I rap cause there ain't no one better. They stirring the pot in the kettle. Ballin' on niggas, no pressure. Dance on the beat like it's stubble. Said I dance on the beat like it's stubble. Blurry vision, run up the money, count the digits. Speaking the truth, and they gotta listen. Real in the fake, man, I know the difference. Pay on the day when they catch me slipping. See through the hill with my cardi lenses. Count up the money and count your blessings. Count up the money and count your blessings. Yeah. My fit cost a lie, you can tell by the kicks. Know what I'm doing, can tell by the drip. Hoes on my body, can tell by your bitch. Bitches, they like me, that's just how it is. No, I'm not still going for your tricks. Bar up the act, I might take me a sip. Book me a fat, I might take me a trip. You wanna look so you take me a flip. Level up, I can tell that you basic. Dress it up, I can dress like I'm famous. Step it up, diamonds dancing like angels. Switch it up, man, I'm going through phases. On and off, man, this shit keep on changing, moving on. Man, I'm flipping the pages, paper trails. I ain't leaving no traces, paper trails. I ain't leaving no traces. Simmer down, feeling like on edge, drip a drown. Gotta speak up so they listen now. Trying to perform for the bigger crowd. Stay in the game for a couple rounds. Stay in the game, you know, in and now. Trying to go global, get bigger now. Trying to go global, get bigger. Uh, remember me, I don't want me seen as the enemy. I'm tired of draining my energy. I know I'm gonna look at the recipe. I know they trying to see the end of me. Go to the riches and plenty green. Walk with a chop like I'm Anna Lee. I'm gonna be the greatest you've ever seen. Yeah. Me neither. Look, <laughs> censoring, censoring himself. We love y'all. Say bye later. <laughs> Mega. <laughs>